You're our dream Fuck. guest. Yeah, yo, you have a great voice. Oh, no, I don't think of, no, my regular voice, I don't think about it, but when I put on a voice, then I know I got a voice. Welcome to the universe. See, I could do that. Wow. That's like the planetarium. That's the voice coming out of the sky. It can't be pipsqueak, high squeaky. Yeah. It doesn't work. Yeah. Like sky voices. Have to be <laughs> sky, sky. Oh, like like a like a Morgan Freeman. <laughs> sky level. voices is amazing. No, yeah. like, man, you you got a great voiceover voice. You just all around great, Neil. Like, I, bro, I'll just say it. You're our dream guest, dude. Actually. What? Yeah, yeah, you're our dream what? guest. Yeah, yeah. I, I saw your guest. You had some guests. Yeah. You had some guests. You had some guests. Yeah, but I, dude, I'm a nerd. Like I geek no, here's out what I listening found. Here's what to I found. you. Many people in the public eye who have other identities. There's a secret geek underbelly that they have. Geek underbelly. And just uh, <laughs> I, I love that. Geek, geek, secret underbelly, geek underbelly. In, in the right moment, in the right situation, then they just geek out. Yeah. It's like, tell me about like black holes and yeah, the Big yeah, Bang yeah. and is there God? And is there and all the questions just flow. And as an educator, that is joy. Dude, I, it's it's an honor to say we have the sexiest astrophysicist alive in the room. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Neil deGrasse Tyson. <laughs>